Warning, viewer discretion is advised. On Obscure Terrain's fifth adventure, they were joined by a unique character who goes by the name of Francisco Tafoya. During their trip, they were hit by a snowstorm that lasted the entire day. So you can imagine, some of the things they said and did could not be aired on the actual episode, Valley of Fires. So once again, we bring you this crap, Diaries on the Trail. But let's face it, these three showed bravery. They were even courageous. Or maybe they were just plain stupid. Because really, who enters a volcanic field during a snowstorm? Now ask yourself that question. Oh, these three do. What's up guys? What's up? How you doing? Pretty good. Pretty pretty crazy. Pretty nervous. Never been to a volcano before. It's not active, bro. It's old. You don't it's not that big. Oh, okay, whatever. A volcano can pop at any second. Like a pimp. What's up? How's it going guys? Introduce yourself. <laughs> My name is Francisco Tafoya. <laughs> Perfect man. We're heading to Carrizozo. I brought these candies because if I die in a volcano, I at least want to eat my favorite candies. So I don't know if you're superstitious, but this black cat escaping. Black cat crossed our path. Guess we ain't coming back. All right, guys, we just barely walked through some valley of fires. What do you guys think of it so far? I'm wondering what my health insurance deductible is. <laughs> These guys over here, these guys, oh my gosh. Of course, it comes to the night before our trips and we tend to not behave. I don't know what it is. We got them Tecate lights. <laughs> this is a crazy one, bro. This is the craziest one of all, I think. So out of all the trips, this has been the craziest. First of all, I somehow managed to lose two gallons of water. Like an <laughs> asshole. I mean, like a... Like a... Uh, just bleep me. Uh, <laughs> but... <laughs> but this is crazy, dude. The terrain is so harsh, like, every step was unforgiving. Like, I could feel it on my feet. And look at how thick these boots are. And I could, like, my feet hurt from stepping on rocks. Mm. The terrain's crazy, there's cracks and crevices everywhere. It's completely unhospitable to man. Yet we're right here. Mm. <laughs> mm, that's the cave shadows. They tell a story. <laughs> a story of the Tas oh. Tasmanian tiger. Bro, the Tasmanian tiger can open its jaw way more than that. <laughs> Nap. Fail. <laughs> yeah, I... <laughs> okay, cool. So it's up from the cave. What's up, what's up? What's up? This what's is the cave on the wide. What is this cave called? Oh shit, we should call this cave. We should call it Hot Top Volcano. I'm just kidding. <laughs> We are live from the Airbnb cave! <laughs> Airbnb cave! This is the coolest fing Airbnb. <laughs> it's the best one I've ever been to. And we hid a golden stone here. So if you can find this <laughs> cave, that golden stone is yours. <laughs> Good luck, guys. <laughs> so we came up over that ridge right there. And we looked across this little uh, little crevasse here, and we saw this guy, Wesley. Practicing that rubber guard. What? what? <laughs> I'm down for another cup of coffee, cause after this we're gonna be in a shit hole. <laughs> I in a hole. Or, or a crevasse. 
We actually went a long ways. I can't say it now. <laughs> so we actually went a long ways, even though we walked the field. I just hear squeaking in the back. <laughs> Just real quick. We actually went a long ways. In the field, we walked about five miles, and then we got here. Too much? Okay. Well, guys, ladies and gentlemen, it's official. Our first guest died. Our first guest death. He died. Look at him. Have you ever seen a corpse smile? Well, look at this one. Smile. Tickle it. Tickle it. <laughs> he really is dead. Oh, he did die. You're a pretty good actor. Yeah, I bet you can't stay still. <laughs> <laughs>